Hey team, back here, R&B, although today is a bit of a funny one because Rob and I have had a little bit of a fight and we've decided to split up. Yep, that's right, we're breaking up. No, just joking guys, we wouldn't do that to you. We're just splitting up for the day because Robbie has decided that he wants to do some yoga and uh, I've had a little bit of a sore hamstring so I don't want to do any stretching and I want to get into the gym and do some rehab and uh, get the strength back into the hamstrings. So today is going to be all about one percenters and the extra activities that we do outside of training that will add up to give us an advantage throughout a game. So one percenters these days have become so scientific. I'll give you an example. Nutrition. Nutrition for a footballer is to figure out what type of food groups to have throughout training to be able to recover for the next day. So it's really difficult to be able to understand it all and figure out what type of nutrition needs to go into being able to give your body enough energy so that we can then perform at our optimum level. So that's just one of the things that we need to do as an extra one percenter to be able to gain advantage on our opponents. So enough talking now about that. We're gonna get down to the gym, we're gonna go do our rehab, and we're gonna let Robbie go to do some stretching. All right, let's do it. I usually start on the bike to warm up, uh, but today because I'm a bit sore, I'm gonna do a bit longer on the bike and uh, stretch it out, so I'll probably be on here for 20, 25 minutes. Alright guys, I'll quickly fill you in on what I'm doing today. Uh, I'm doing isometric training, which is basically where the joint angle and the muscle length does not change. Uh, so I'll get in a position where uh, I've got the weight on my leg and I'll basically hold it there. Uh, 45 seconds and a minute and a half off. Uh, if you've got any weakness in your muscles, this is the best training to start off with. And then you can progress to concentric training, eccentric training, and then back to obviously explosive running, jumping, sprinting, etc. So let's get it done, guys. <laughs>
All right, guys, I'm done here in the gym today. Sweated a fair amount, done my isometric training. Robbie's done his yoga. We're both working hard. We're both gaining that advantage at the end of the day. So if you're wanting to get to the next level, make sure you're doing those one percenters, whether it's nutrition, resting, recovering, or even just doing these activities, as I say. So get them done. Thanks for tuning in. See you next time.